Hi guys, it's uh, Wayne Wayne's Butler here. Uh, this is my first YouTube video, and I want to dedicate it to my new friend, Mike Echo. As you can see here, it's the the jail cell for the jail cell Joker. Uh, it's all scratch built. Uh, as you can see inside, you got the toilet and the bed and sink. The toilet I got from a Barbie's bathroom set. Uh, and you got the bed. Mattress is made out of actually the same one inch pink foam that I made the walls out of. Open it up here for you. As you can see inside, I've taken some of the design cues from Mike Eccles' jail cell. Added a few extra things. Try to weather things as much as I could. I'll pan up the top here. This piece at the top here, it's supposed to represent the substructure of the floor above. It's the first time I've ever made anything this large. But it is what it is, what you see there. The walls are made out of one inch pink foam, scribed and weathered and washed. I don't know how much time I got guys, I don't want to ramble on so I move on here. I want to take you into this room real quick. As you can see here it's all model railway stuff. It was what I was into before I discovered Hot Toys. Everything here has been scratch built. Anyways, it's not Hot Toys stuff guys. I just want to give you a bit of an introduction. But anyways, we'll go down to the what I like to call the Bat Cave. Got a few things going on down here, I guess. Don't want to make it too get dizzy, guys. I don't know how this video is going to turn out, so don't crap on me too much in the comment section. It's more of an experiment than anything. And as you can see here, it's a another diorama inspired by my buddy Mike Echo. It's the holding tank. As you can see, it's your standard Joker. Actually, it's the uniform for, from the first Joker. Head sculpt from the bank robber. So actually, I have a TTL body on it right now. They're a bit of a crap body, but they're they are cheap. You get what you pay for. But as you see here, it's it's the same uh, holding cell that, that my buddy Mike made. If you go to his channel. You can see how it's made. I made it the same way he did. And I come over here. It's This is my uh, custom Bruce Wayne. As you can tell, it's a bit of a Mogi inspiration. Another great YouTuber. And we'll pan up here to the, the main part of the collection. a bit of a glass in the front here guys. I hope it doesn't glare too much. But anyways, as you can see, it's all the standard Hot Toy stuff. You've seen it a million times. Start here with the Bank Robber Joker with the patented Mike Echo pose and a bit of a Mogi pose here for the Scarecrow. A bit of a D Knight pose here for the Demon. Standard pose for the Joker. And we got the Nurse Joker. That was the hardest figure to get out of all of them. I had a hell of a time getting the uniform. But as you can see, I customized it a little bit. Repainted the wig, the correct carrot top red from the movie. I actually got underwear on this one. I got a tank top and boxers underneath. And uh, I did have the Argyle socks on it, but it's on the holding tank joker right now. I'm not paying $40 for a new set of socks. Anyways guys, I know it's quick. I have a DXO2 upstairs in my bedroom with a bunch of other hot toys. I got my house broken into there last year. So my DXO2 is my most valuable collection, so I have it locked in a showcase in my vault. But anyways guys, that's it. And uh, hopefully we have some other videos coming. We'll talk to you later guys. I appreciate it. Thanks.